Hey, what's going on YouTube? Hey, so today I came across an awesome blog post on a uh, site called PurposeFairy.com called the 15 things you need to give up to be happy and I thought it was the coolest thing and I wanted to share it with you guys to, to maybe help you guys uh, give you some more insight on your daily living. Uh, the first thing that I read on here was to give up your need to always be right. Uh, first of all, there's so many of us who can't stand the idea of being wrong, myself included. Uh, however, by fighting and by trying to prove yourself right, next thing you know you'll cause some crazy rips in your relationships. Next thing is give up your need for control. You need to be willing to give up your need to always control everything that happens to you and around you. Let life happen. Let things happen. All right. Uh, just let things be. Next thing is give up on blame. You need to give up your need to blame others and for what you have or what you don't have, what you feel, what you don't feel, what you've achieved, what you haven't achieved. Take responsibility. Don't pass out the blame. Number four, give up your self-defeating self-talk. All right, there's a lot of folks out there that have negative thoughts about themselves. I'm ugly, I'm fat, I'm hairy, got big old boogers hanging on my nose, whatever. I can't do this, I can't do that. Give up all that, that bad self-talk. Push it out there, be a positive person to help you develop more in the future. Next thing is give up your limiting beliefs about what you can or cannot do. Never say I can't do that. Never say I, I cannot achieve that. Everyone has limitless potential. Okay. Next one is give up complaining. Give up the need to keep complaining about things. Instead, do something about it. Instead of complaining, make a change. Do something about it. Number seven, give up your luxury of criticism. We always have the desire to criticize things, people, things, events, whatever. Stop reading about criticizing stuff. Stop thinking so negatively. Do something about it. Okay. Uh, we want to be happy. We want something and we want something uh, for everybody. Next thing is give up your need to impress others. That's a big issue that I have because I like being an impressive guy. Uh, but with that said, you know, if you're constantly in fear or constantly in desire of trying to impress other folks, you're never going to achieve your own goals. You're never going to achieve the things that you want to do or purchase things that you want because you're going to be so concerned about impressing other people. Next thing is give up your resistance to change. Uh, there's Ben Franklin said that there's three th two things in life that are guaranteed, right? Death and taxes. Um, I think there's a third thing in life that's guaranteed, and that's change. Change is always going to happen. If you resist change, you're never going to get anywhere. Next one is number 10, give up labels. Stop labeling things, people, or events that you don't understand as being weird or different. Hey, everybody is their own person. Everybody has their own choice in life. Let them be, okay? Minds only work when open, they always say. Number 11, give up on your fears. Be fearless. Do things without hesitation, all right? Fear is just an illusion. It doesn't exist. You created it. It's a mental condition, okay? Number 12, give up excuses. Stop making excuses for things. Just go out and do it. You know, for, for myself, I've been making excuses for months and years to get started on YouTube. I kind of started up a little bit and I dropped off. I kept making excuses of why yeah, I'll do it tomorrow, I'll do it next week, whatever. Just get out and do it, okay? Just do it. Number 13, give up the past. Stop recollecting in the past. The past is already gone. You want to be concerned about the present and the future. Okay, there's nothing you do to change the past, nothing you do to fix the errors that you've made, learn from your mistakes, move on, suck it up. Number 14, give up attachment. This is a tough one. A lot of us grasp just the same thing that's linked to uh, being linked to the past. You get attached to things, you get emotionally attached to things, you get emotionally attached to your investments, um, stocks and bonds, or you get emotionally attached to certain things inside the house or whatever. Give up those attachments. Don't be attached to things. Just be able to get up and move, okay? Don't give, don't attach, get yourself attached to things. And finally, this is the biggest thing, is number 15, give up living your life to other people's expectations. Uh, for many years, when I was younger, my father has always told me, you're gonna be a doctor or an attorney. And I kept trying to live up to that expectation. I was never happy about myself. I was always a entrepreneur, self-employed guy, and that's who I was, that's who I am today, and that's who I still am. All right, if you keep trying to live up to your uh, other people's expectations, like your parents or your friends or your spouse or whatever, you'll never be able to achieve your fullest potential. All right. So again, I got this from PurposeFairy.com. It's called The 15 Things You Should Give Up To Be Happy. Awesome, awesome blog post. I'll put a link in my uh, comments below so you guys can link right into it, read it in greater detail, and get some of the cool quotes that they put up on there. Again, folks, uh, have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon.